Beauty is not in the face. Beauty is the light of the heart. With these sayings of Khalil Gibran, good evening to one and all gathered here. I am Akshara of MSc Software Systems, representing KG College of Arts and Science, is here with the topic, Beauty is always in the eyes of the beholder. According to me, beauty has nothing to do with looks. It has everything to do with how you are as a person and how you make others feel about themselves. To be beautiful means to be yourself. You don't need to be accepted by others. You need to accept yourself. Let me relate this with a story. A little girl went to her mother and asked, Am I looking good in this new dress, mom? The mother said, Yes, of course, my child. You are the most beautiful girl in the whole wide world. The little girl mourned and said, You say so because you are my mother. Is that the same that others think about me? The mother patted her child and said, Yes, I say, because I am the only one who knows about you. Only I can feel the inner beauty you possess with your dark skin and crooked nose. Everything is beautiful, but not everyone sees it. We go and stand in front of a mirror for a long time until we get a call from our mother. What do we do there? Either we feel bad for our appearance or we feel proud. Is that all important in our life? Yes, of course it is important but not essential. Yes, my friends, remember, beauty is important, but not essential. A true beauty of one is felt by others only when you hold a good health, a good character, and a good talent. Let us all think for a while. How many of us remember the significance of physical beauty when we talk about Nelson Mandela, the first president of South Africa, do you still think that beauty is important even after we hold eminent sport personalities like Mary Combe and P.T. Usha? Why is that to think about other personalities? Let us think of her mother. Is she not beautiful? Yes, of course she is beautiful. She pleases us with her beauty. The beauty that I meant here was not her physical appearance, but the care and the unconditional love she showers upon us. The beauty of mind and the beauty of body are of two different qualities. Some may have either one of them or a lucky few may have both. Yet, majority of us depends upon the superficial beauty and appearance. Each one of us have our own talent and have our own interest. Discover your talent and work for the refinement of your interest. Let me conclude this speech by saying, beauty attracts the eyes but personality captures the heart. Thank you all for giving me this wonderful opportunity.